morning you guys hello welcome back to my channel you guys be sure to like this video comment subscribe to my channel cornaya vlogs because i will starting today i'm going to be starting i'm going to be posting content on cornaya vlogs every single day so you're going to be seeing stuff that i do every day like probably my morning routine probably my afternoon routine probably my night routine mom life like i'm about to start posting more and stuff like that so cornaya vlogs all right you guys i'm about to start posting day long cornaya vlogs you're about to see more vlogs of me so comment down below if you want to see more vlogs of me comment down below make sure you like this video like comment subscribe turn on your post notifications and make sure you're watching my video to the very last end thank you watch to the very last end i'm about to make two packs of oatmeal for breakfast i'm gonna do the quaker brand um instant oatmeal raisin date and walnut all right let's um let's get this thumbnail Yeah, I gotta um, retwist my hair right here. Y'all, I really don't like the way this lady did my hair. She did my hair so ugly. Yeah, I really don't like the way she did my hair. I feel like she didn't do it good enough or whatever. So, y'all, hold on. Hopefully, this thumbnail will be good enough. 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 Hopefully, this she was supposed to, you know, retwist it, wash it, and style it. Tell me why when, when I left her shop, it was like a week ago. I left her shop, my edges were still looking like this. Usually when people retwist my hair, they make my edges look all smooth. They put a little, you know, a little gel on it. On them. Make it look real good. She's supposed to wash our hair because that's what we paid for. We paid for it on the app. So by us paying for it on the app, we paid to get it washed, washed, retwist it, and style. She asked us a million times, y'all gonna get y'all hair washed, y'all gonna get y'all gonna get y'all hair washed. I started to say, you done asked us this several times, plus it's on the app. It should tell you. And then when it was time to get a style, y'all get y'all hair style, y'all get y'all hair style. It's on the fucking app. We just kept telling her, yes. I guess she wanted us to change our mind. So that's pretty much why she kept asking, like, y'all gonna get y'all hair style, y'all get y'all hair style, y'all get y'all hair washed, y'all get y'all hair washed. Y'all, when it was time for the wash y'all hair, tell me why. Tell me why she did not wash our hair. She put soap on our hair and washed it for like five or six seconds. It was that bitch was trying to wet our hair. That was she was trying to do wet our hair. Like that's why I don't like the um I don't like to use that style C app because I've noticed in the past when I use the style C app one time, I noticed that the person that I used it for like y'all he did my hair so messed up. I remember when he did my hair on style C, he did not talk to me the whole time, even though I was talking to him. He kept asking me once I could get a style. And then the night before, he texted me and told me to come wash. And I said, I, 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 I paid you to get my hair washed. I paid you through the app. I just kept telling him, he was like, hang on, baby, why my hair? Because I had locks. What? And I, and I paid him through the L. I should have got my money back. I should have called Coastal Service and got my money back. By the kindness of my heart, I gave him a five star. Do y'all think, but that was years ago, do y'all think that we should get this lady a three star or a two star? Because we're going to get her a three star, but I feel like she deserves a one star. Because like I said, my edges weren't done. The way she retwisted it was just, ugh. And she put these big twists in my head. Like, if I'm, if I'm telling you I want these twists, why would you make them this big? And then they've been coming apart for days now. Now, let me tell you, our other hairstylist, she had just had a baby. But our other hairstylist, she would twist our hair and it would be so fucking cute. Edges would be laid, locks would be retwisted. It would be laid perfectly. Um, Everything just perfect. When I say perfect, perfect. She don't be doing these big ass twists right here. These twists are too big. You see this? This one medium, this one large. And then you got one in the back, large as fuck. And then one on large and one medium. And then one small. Come on now. It, this that is like something I did. If you didn't want to wash my hair and style it, you should have just put on the outfit. The only thing you able to do is retwist it. So basically she didn't wash it and she barely restyled it. It just look a mess. 
and then it's coming apart. Like I said, with our other hairstylists, whenever she do it, it don't never come apart. Let me say, me and my husband, like, even though she tell us to take it down after like three or four weeks, we keep it up for like six weeks. And the whole six weeks, it do not come apart. Look at it. This came apart in the first few days. Yeah. Yeah, and when I say you like our other hairstylist, she, she do the best. She take the time out to wash our hair for at least five minutes. And that's amazing. She actually wash it really, 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 really good. And she wash it with Dr. Bonner. So she used safe products to wash her hair. This other lady, I don't know what she be having going on. She used chemicals. Y'all help me. Y'all come freaking help me, bro. But like for real, this lady right here, who did I have? See, she did I have like a week ago. Like I said, she didn't do my edges. She did my twists too big, some too big, some too small. But I said I'm gonna worry about it. Even though my husband paid his money for it, I don't worry about it. We just not gonna go back to her no more. My husband and like. My husband didn't, didn't, didn't like the service either because cause he felt like she didn't wash the hair long enough. And I agree. She really didn't wash the hair long enough. She, he was like, she only washed his hair for probably about a minute, if that. Yeah, she really just put some soap on there and rinsed it off. That's it. Just rinse, just rinse the head, put a little soap on there, and just rinse it. I didn't even feel this. Because you know like when somebody's going to wash your hair, and you, you know like when it's dirty. Your head will start to itch. She didn't get them spots on that. Yeah, because the bitch. Cause she ain't no bitch though. Because she just didn't wash it right. Like at all. She barely even washed it. That little 20 second, 5 second wash. Child. That's why I told my husband. I said, you got to be careful because you go to. <coughs> You have to be real careful who you go to, you guys. Like I said, make sure you like this video. Make sure you comment on this video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you turn on your post notifications because, of course, like I said, I'm going to be posting daily content. So I would love for y'all to be watching me. On Cornelia Vlogs, you're going to see more Cornelia Vlogs. Not the family Vlogs, you know, my little family of four. Not me and my children. Like, you're going to see me and my children sometimes. You're going to see me and my husband sometimes. You're going to see me, my husband, my children sometimes. But if you want to see more of me and my children, it's on my other channel. If you want to see more of me and my husband, that's on my other channel. Make sure you subscribe to those channels. Cornaya and Larry. Cornaya. Cornaya Vlogs. C with the T. Make, you, make sure you subscribe to those channels. Make sure you subscribe to Larry Vlogs also. Please subscribe to all of those channels, please. Subscribe to all of those channels. That will help us out a lot. That will help us out a lot, y'all. Mm. Make sure you are drinking your water. When you get up in the morning, make sure you're taking your deep breaths early in the morning. So for this month of June, you're gonna see a, you you're gonna get at least one vlog from me every day. Thirty days of vlogging. Make sure y'all are watching me. Watch the video to the very last end, you guys. Please, 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 please support me, you guys. I've been on YouTube a whole year now, almost two years, and I've posted over two thousand videos within two years. And I just feel like, I, well, I've been on YouTube almost two. Years. I've been on YouTube for a whole year, basically, and I posted two thousand videos. I feel like I'm not getting the support that I need. So honestly, I'm just finna, I'm probably finna quit. 
if I was doing this for the money, I would have been quick, obviously, because over 2,000 videos in one, in one year, like, <laughs> and people still not watching me. I know, I know what y'all like to see. Y'all like to see them cringy ass pranks that your favorite YouTuber do. Your favorite YouTuber do those cringy ass, sick ass pranks, and that's what you want to see on my page. You like you might see a prank or two, but honestly, from the beginning, I I've never been into pranks at all. I don't do that shit, bro. It's just not me. Like I would watch somebody's video of them doing a prank, like. Honestly, like, I do got pranks on my page because, like, I kind of made myself do them because, like, I feel like that's the only time people are watching is when you do pranks or when you do skits or stuff like that. So, I be feeling like I have to make myself, like, change up what I actually like and what I want to do. Because I know most people would look at my content as boring. Because I'm not fighting. I'm not cursing nobody out. I'm not doing no cringy pranks. But I think I'm going to have to start doing a prank or two. Like, I, I got, like, probably, in all, I probably got, like, ten pranks that I done did within a year. And they're not really that bad. But even though, even though the pranks not really that bad, it still be folks in my comments trolling me. Like, being missing, being mean. Like, one person comment on that video uh, me and my husband pranking our children talking about that's the crackhead residence and stuff like that Like how dare you say that's the crackhead residence and it's got something to do with my children It's okay though cuz I let that voodoo handle him I let that voodoo handle him boom 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 let me stop y'all this is all for entertainment purposes only if you are not entertained and then get off the video if you don't want to be entertained <laughs> this is all for entertainment purposes only but um oh these damn next piss me off y'all let me show y'all something say hello to my little friend Say hello to my little friend. Say hello to my little friend. Alright, you guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. As you can see, my oatmeal is done. Thank y'all so very much for watching my video to the very last end. Like, comment, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications so you can be notified each and every time I post you guys. And make sure you are watching my videos to the very last end. Stop clicking off my video within the first 30 seconds. Period. Say hello to my little friend. Pew. Pew. Say hello to my little friend. <laughs> Say hello to my little friend.